Hey, this is a quick tutorial for my co-teachers and friends to use the remote desktop Chrome extension. Thank you to my student aide Lillian, who's a senior and wants to be a teacher. So this is gonna help her out in years to come. Thank you, Lillian, for helping me today. Well, of course. Okay, so teacher friends, first things first, you need to have the remote desktop from Chrome open. It'll just make it easier for you. You need to highlight this and you can hit Command C or right click and copy. Go back to your Google Meet. You're gonna come over to the chat box up here where it says chat with everyone and go down here to send a message and you're going to right click and paste that or you can hit command v next you have to type the forward slash button and then you have to type in the word session then forward slash go back to the remote desktop tab and i'm going to need you to hit generate code you can click this link to copy it to your clipboard, or if you click on the box, you can highlight it, right click and copy it. I prefer to just click and copy it to my clipboard. Go back to your chat, make sure that that forward slash is there, and you are going to paste the number. So see when I pasted it there, the slash went away, so I need to make sure I enter that forward slash. Two slashes in between the session. I'm going to send that to Lillian. You can see that there's a remote desktop that was sent prior and then one later. When you're doing this, you have to have your student click on the most recent one that has been sent. So Lillian, this is where you come in, okay? Okay. Open up your chat. Okay which teachers on the side of things, the chat looks just like it does for us. It's right up here. And you see that there's two, um, two links that I sent you. I want you to go to the one that was sent at 11.01 a.m. Okay. And can you click that, please? Yeah. It's loading. Okay. So now on my desktop, it asks if I would like to share my computer with you. I'm going to click share. So now Lillian, I'm going to move the mouse over into the chat. Do you see that I've done that? Yeah. Okay. I'm going to put my hands up in the air so everybody can see this. Lillian, what do you see on your side of things? Are my hands in the air? Yeah. With who's in the behind me? Lisa. COVID edition. Can you go please shut the um, chat window? Awesome. So now what I want you to do is go up and open a new tab. Yep, hit that arrow. That's awesome. So now let's go and type in solitaire. Like the game. It's a card game. There you go. And that is how you share your remote access, give your kids access to your computer. There will be another lesson that comes along with this. This is just so you can teach your kids. And I use Solitaire to make sure they understand that you're using my desktop. And then I can take it. So just even real fast. I just hit that on play for Lillian. I'm gonna hit this easy. So it's small right now. Lillian. Yeah. Take the red two and click click drag the two to the three. The black three. Awesome. Now if I didn't like that, or I'm gonna do the next one. Lillian, I'm moving the mouse right now. I'm gonna take the five and I'm gonna move it to the six. Okay, but guess what? I want you to do it. Your turn. Good 
job, Lillian. That was awesome.